Hi again everybody, this is a quick follow-up to the previous video I did about a week ago about the Technique speakers I was going to tear apart. So I have taken uh, one of them apart and I was just looking at the construction of some of these speakers. Wonderful construction qualities in these. And this is the woofer. You can see I've used duct tape <laughs> as a desperate last ditch attempt to try to get these things to, to not rattle and whatever. But uh, the surrounds are completely baffed and they can't be replaced. So we have it's the honeycomb system. That's why it's called the Techniques Honeycomb Disc. The disc is actually like a wafer. It's a honeycomb type of wafer. It's thin, but it's got pockets and ribs and things like that in here. So uh, it's an interesting technology. If you look inside there, it's, uh, there's a big plastic cone in there very very heavy weight on the bottom they're called Techniques 392 C's on that woofer it's a 10 inch now the mids it's almost the same construction made by Techniques as well you can see the plastic uh, all around it. Very well constructed, very solid speaker. And if you look inside, it's uh, the inside is very similar to the woofer, although these are in much better shape. And the mid also had a case that you just put it in like that. Real workmanship here by techniques when they design these. This is the tweeter and like I said there is a, a grill here in the front. Take it off, there's a gasket. Built by techniques in Japan. Very well done. And they are all fastened together and connected at the back where the connector is. And uh, the crossover. And the crossover is excellent construction for this piece. Some caps there. It's just a beautiful piece of construction. Very high quality speaker. It's a shame they couldn't get the woofers right. So this video is going out to the people that like some of the more technical things, like seeing the parts, speakers, things like that. Thanks for watching.